integrating functional medicine into specific condition of Alzheimer's disease. And functional medicine is the understanding that we have multi, there's it's multifactorial causes and contributing factors in our lifestyle that lead to the expression of different genes, the turning on, turning off of some of those genes to lead to an expression uh, that gets a sign or a symptom that then can lead to a diagnosis, right? And so functional medicine is all about addressing the root cause. So with the RECODE protocol, what we do is we're looking at biomarkers, so different saliva, stool, blood work, to try to pull out information about almost like a GPS trying to locate where the person is at this given time. And we classify them in different types. So type 1, as an example, is inflammation. Type 1.5 is glycotoxicity, where we have this disruption of glucose and insulin and uh, damage to the nerves in the brain and the inability to drive glucose into those cells. Right? Type 2 is atrophic. Type 3 is toxic. Type 4 and type 5, we have vascular influences as well as previous traumas. So these, think of these things as almost silos, right? And so we're utilizing blood work, history, um, other types of tests to try to distinguish which one of these silos might be raising its hand the highest. And the one that's raising its hand is highest, how do we go about addressing those underlying causes in that person's life? So it's the RECODE protocol is all about taking recommendations, let me, let me rephrase, rephrase this, the RECODE protocol is all about taking uh, this data, integrating it with a person's history, and then marrying the two to come up with a precise protocol that is right for the individual, and that addresses lifestyle, exercise, sleep, nutrition, supplementation, potentially some medications when necessary. It's about how do we get precise for this person at this time in this given moment. Um, pause for a second. So 